Yo, all you beautiful boys and girls, what is going on? I hope you guys are having a good day. And my tummy just rumbled. You won't have picked that up on the microphone. I'm going to turn my light off because I just noticed that the camera just went, you know that lighting that you you need ever so badly? Nah. Fucking, I'm having so many problems. There was supposed to be a gaming video out today, but I recorded it last night and I've just gone to edit it and the majority of my footage was fucked up. So I'm kind of pissed off. But anyway, I don't want to be pissed off for this video because I actually have a thank you to make. I know I did one of these, I can't believe it was a month ago. Um, We hit 60 subscribers. And now we're at 70 subscribers. And I can't fucking believe it. Thank you guys so much. 70 might not seem like a lot, but just visualize 70 people in a room. It is a lot of people. Um, all watching your content, well not all, but the majority watching your content, that, that is so heartwarming. And it just makes me so happy to know that people are watching my content. I mean, I'm a kid that not many people know, not many people should know on YouTube. I have shit lights, a shit computer, shit camera, shit microphone, broken microphone stand. I have probably the most basic setup you'll ever get but in a way I am lucky because there's kids who can't even get this there's kids who can't even get what I've got this isn't my computer this is my brother's but my brother's nice enough to l uh, let me borrow it but in a way I'm lucky because I've got a lot of stuff that kids don't have like I have a smartphone I have a BMX I did have an iPod but it broke I've got a roof over my head clothes on my back, I have food. A lot of kids don't even have that and that kind of makes me sad. But it's just kind of, I know I say it a lot and I will continue to say it and if it annoys you then I'm sorry. But you guys mean so freaking much to me and there's been times when I've been sat in this chair nearly in fucking tears because of something that has happened with my footage or my footage has all gone corrupt when I've gone to put it in the editing or just audacity is just being a gigantic pile of turd that day and just I get I I get a lot of hate comments but I also get a lot of nice comments and the hate comments are like yeah okay I guess and then I get the nice comments it's like yeah this is this is what I do it for I got a nice comment the other day, um, and it that actually made me smile. It really did, um, and it just outweighs all the bad comments. The bad comments every time they come in now, I just look at them and go, "Yeah, okay, whatever." Now, obviously, they everybody knows that little fucking prod that you're gonna get, and it's like that hurt out in the heart. Even though my heart's that side, but go fuck yourself, um, but. You guys are so supportive, and you don't turn on each other either, which is what I love. Maybe if the community gets a bit bigger, you might start turning on each other. Now, I never want the community to be like that. I want to have such a strong community on this channel. Um, I want us to be one big family, basically. And yes, we will argue and we will fight, because families do. But I don't ever want us to fall out with each other or anything like that. Obviously, spam, bullying, or anything like that will not be tolerated. You will be banned like that. I don't care how much of a big fan you are. If you are bullying someone, you are banned instantly. Um, because I do not tolerate it, no matter what the circumstance is. I don't care what's happened. I don't tolerate it. Um, but we're only at 70 subscribers yet, so kind of, I don't have to worry about that yet. But it, it kind of humbles me really. Now, my sleeping pattern fucked anyway. But there is a lot of nights when I stay up doing YouTube stuff. And when I say doing YouTube stuff, I don't just mean making, recording, or recording, editing, and rendering a video. Because that's what a lot of people think YouTube is. is just, oh, I can record a video and upload it. And to be honest, that's what I thought it was before I started. It's just like, I can record a video with my face and voice over the top and then upload it to YouTube. Anybody can. 
and look at how long it took me to actually set up the game recordings. So yeah, it's not as easy as I thought it was. But I've come this far. I have come this far and thank you to the people who have shared the channel. Thank you to the people that have liked my videos. That have even just given me like one chance that's like, nope, this channel's not for me and I've gone. That's fine. I'm not for everybody. I'm loud, I'm obnoxious, I'm an asshole. I don't give a shit what people say. Um believe me, if you know me in real life, I'm a very loud person. I'm just a lot more mellowed on YouTube because I'm still kinda shy, I guess. And you can hear it in my voice sometimes, like, when I'm breathing, you can hear the shakiness in my voice because I'm trying to, I talk quickly and I'm trying to function everything properly and say everything properly so that people can understand me. And I know I shouldn't, I should probably just be myself and people will accept me whether, kind of, whether they want to or not. Or people will accept me if they want to and they won't if they won't, that's what I meant to say. Um... It, just, it makes me so happy, even to know that family watch my videos. Like, my brother watches some of my videos, I think. And there's a plane outside. Shut up, you noisy fucker. I'm trying to record here. You fucking hell, I'm blind now. You probably can't hear it. In fact, you probably can. It's fucking loud, bastard. Um, but my auntie and my uncle have told me that they watched a couple of videos. And that's so fucking humbling, man. Um, that so many people watch my videos is just so fucking humbling because I never dreamed of this when I I knew when I started YouTube when I was doing the vlogs I knew I always wanted to be a gaming youtuber because the youtubers I watched at the time that inspired me I was kind of like I don't know but then I wa started watching Jacksepticeye and it's like yes I can be like that man and then it's like well no I need to put my own twist on it but he's been a big inspiration as a lot of you know um, and I, I don't even know anymore. I, I've always wanted to be a gaming YouTuber, but the problem is money. Um, I've managed to save up and get Train Simulator, which is which has got about 15 minutes left on the download. So hopefully, I should be able to play that. Simulator games might not be for everybody, but I do quite like simulator games. Um, so hopefully that will work okay. For some reason, when I record a long video, Audacity just goes, no, I'm just going to take a shite on myself. Because fuck you too. So, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. Audacity keeps taking a shit on itself. It did in the Need for Speed video. Which is why I said like all my files fucked up and shit. Um, I used... It's caught on my foot. Give me a second. I used that to record the footage for it. Just ignore the rattling. The stand's come off so there's a screw inside it. Um, I used that to record my footage. Which I probably won't be doing again. Um, and I think Audacity just went... I'm dead now. So, yeah. So, and... Well, yeah. Um, sorry if I've ever like upset anyone or offended anyone. I make jokes kind of to the situation that I feel is okay. Like the joke doesn't go the joke doesn't process first, it's like in and out. In and out. And then it's like, wait, that was my voice. Who said Oh bollocks, that was me that said that. Oh shit. So far I think I've done quite well. I'm learning to filter myself. Like, I swear a lot and I'm not going to stop swearing. Because swearing is fucking fun. Um, so if you don't like swearing or your parents don't like you watching swearing YouTubers, then I'm sorry, but I don't really know what to tell you. I'm not going to stop swearing, so... Yeah. But... I've, I'm, I'm doing quite well at... Not restraining myself, but kind of censoring myself so I don't make offensive jokes. I don't like offensive jokes, but sometimes it's like, like I said, in and out. It just, it's like, I just made an offensive joke. Fuck. And then I'm in trouble. But, I don't know, I've, I get a lot of requests, or lot, not a lot of requests, but I've, I've had some, like, questions before going, how do you, like, how do you start a YouTube channel and stuff, and what can I expect on YouTube? 
three things to expect. Views, subscribers, and hate. That uh, that is the three things to expect really. You will you will get good comments because somebody out there will like your content. But views, subscribers, and hate. When I first started, that's what it was. It was views, subscribers, and hate. Not all hate, but the majority. And I've just been kind of sat here going, cool, I don't give a shit. Because I read all the comments come in. They come through on my phone. Um, so I read all the comments that come in when I actually get fucking notified about them. Um, so, yeah. So for those of you that think I don't read the comments, I do. Some of them I just can't reply to because they're not justifiable for a reply. They're not like questions or something that I can just reply to. So, I don't know. It, I've kind of gone off on a tangent on this video, but just thank you so much. I've, I'm going to be doing these subscriber milestones every 10 up till about 100, I think. And then I'll do them every 50 up until 1,000, which will never happen. But up until a thousand, and then I'll do it every thousand or every hundred or something like that. No, every thousand, so it'll be one thousand, two thousand, three, and then you get picture. But I'm never going to get to that number. I know that. So we'll just focus on a hundred for now. Um, I w I would say I would love to get to hundred subscribers by Christmas, but I don't think that'll happen. Which is completely fine. It's perfectly fine. But I would love to. But anyway, I've been kind of talking a lot, and I'm hungry, so I'm going to go and get food. Um, so yeah, I want to thank you guys so, so much for watching this video, and thank you guys for everything, okay? Just, seriously, thank you guys for everything. It does mean a lot to me. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope you guys have a fantastic day, and I want you guys to stay awesome. So yeah, peace! If you remember from the setup video, the big long mirror, I've got a Black Robe Wide kind of patch, blue tack above the mirror, because I can't find where to put it. I can just sew that to the t-shirt or whatever I'm wearing and I can just like put transfers on it. Um, do people not think of this? You will get $1,000 in the mail every week until you die from an anonymous source. You lose 20 years of your life. Ooh. So let's say I was going to die at 